Hey everyone, Shea Bear 1000 here. So we made it through okay. Uh, when the actual hurricane hit Florida, it wasn't even this windy, so I didn't film anything. We ended up having to move the Corvette from over there, and this we pulled forward. <laughs> that poor vet. Because where it was sitting at, you can see it had some stuff hitting the top of it. So, we came out late last night. We were standing there, and when the vet was sitting over here, it was still getting sticks and stuff on it. Like that. So we thought, well, you know, this is metal, <laughs> and uh, if something happens to the windshield of that, you know, we got insurance, we can replace it. That's not insured yet because we're not driving it yet. So, uh, but yeah, those, those pine needles are from, there's a pine tree way back there, and a pine tree there. So. Yeah. Yeah, that palm tree's moving pretty good. Um, I think we're going to take a ride over to Crystal River and check it out. But uh, yeah, this. But we made it okay. This is just. Yeah, it wasn't this windy when it hit, so I went to bed. <laughs> and uh, now it's windy. I don't even want to go around that thing. I mean, there's there's a possibility that could still hit that, but I would say what would happen if it goes anywhere, it'll go that way. There's a power line right there. Probably hit that power line, maybe slide down that power line. Uh, so, but I think, yeah, it's just that poor, that poor car. See, before we didn't have to worry about it because it's starting to rain. Because uh, when that when that palm tree was still alive, you know, the the Corvette was fine right there where it was. But you know, with that dead now, I don't know if you can see down at the bottom of that tree. See, just didn't want a chance that I don't want anything happening to that thing, you know. So, but we made it. All right, I'll be back with you guys and we'll. Jeez, that's a lot of hood there to collect stuff, you know? <laughs> All right, I'll be back with you. Let's see what we're going to do. Okay guys, so we decided we're going to take a ride over to Crystal River. I got the drone. It's supposed to be flooded. I don't know if it's went down yet, but they're worried about 4 o'clock, you know, high tide coming in. So, usually the storm surges don't last that long. They go out pretty quick. So, and, but apparently they got all the roads blocked off and stuff, so, but uh, I'll see what we can see and uh, if it's too windy to put the drone up, it'll let me know. But we're going to find out what happened. Um, yeah, our power came on back on last night, didn't it? Yeah. yeah. So. That was nice, too. It was quite fast. Wasn't, wasn't, wasn't out very long. Uh -uh. You know, so. But, uh, yeah, I was editing video and power came back on. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so. And then we didn't lose power all night last night. So. Yeah. Um, we didn't get hit hard. We got a lot of rain, though. But. The winds wasn't too bad. It's windier now than when it hit. Yeah. Than when the, than when it hit the, but that's because it was going past us. It hit north of us. So, but Cedar Key, I guess Cedar Key's. Underwater. Well, it's, it's. They said it looks like apocalypse. Yeah. So it's pretty bad. Maybe we'll run over there this weekend. You know. 
Okay, I'm running over to Cedar Key and, and see what's what's going on over there. Maybe we can help somebody. I don't know. We'll see. But yeah, um, so we're we're gonna see what what we can see over here. We're almost there. We're not too far away from it, but we're gonna. Like I said, it's pretty windy. I don't know if the drone will let me put it up, but when it when it, when it gets high high winds, it'll start talking to me and it, it'll say high wind warning land immediately <laughs> so we'll find out um, but I'll see what see what we can get and, and uh, I'll be back with you guys stick around okay guys so we parked about a mile and a half up there and we're walking because they got that closed off they got every street closed off in the Crystal River So, we're going to walk clear up here and see what's going on. If I don't see anything, we're going to go back. So, yeah, that's that's ridiculous. They can block off the whole city. Well, through Hurricane Irma, they actually blocked off the whole state. Yeah. If you left the state of Florida, they said you wasn't getting back in. They can't do that. Come on, people. You know, learn your rights. <laughs> You know, they work for us. We don't work for them. We're not entered into any kind of contract, you know. So, we just walked right by him. Another guy walking his dog with a backpack walked right by him. They didn't say anything. But they're stopping every vehicle. And they're saying it's for the safety of the public. All right. <laughs> so, I'll be back with you. Yeah, he's a big one. Interesting. Telling him he can't go this way. I wonder how he, how he got through. Probably just drove through. He's mad because he wants to go to his home. They can't stop you from going to your home. No, no, they shouldn't. Damn right they shouldn't, because they can't. I don't so like this them. guy just made the guy in the black truck up there leave and go back. I wouldn't. Take me to jail. If I want to go home, I'm going home. This lady up here has to walk down here to the Holiday Inn where they're staying to get her dogs because they would not even let them through to get her dogs. So he has to park up there where the road's blocked and she has to walk down to get her dogs at the Holiday Inn. That's ridiculous. Monkey giving Bruno some water. <laughs> Want more? Want more? Yeah. <laughs> He's done. Okay guys, so we walked about 27 feet from where he was drinking and he just came over and laid down. When he does that, he's too tired to continue, so we're going to go back. We're not going to make him yeah. walk the rest of the way and then carry him. all the way back. So Monkey's going to carry him and yeah. So We were so close, but so far away. So yeah. we're, we still have a ways to go. No, quarter mile. Yeah. 1,400 feet. If that. And that lady, she was mad. 
Oh, I would be yeah. too. You keep saying that. Yeah, I'd be pissed. I can't go home. I, I'm not allowed to go get my dogs. Here's the thing. They'll let you walk back here to go get your dogs. They won't let you drive back here to go get your dogs. Yeah, she had to go all the way to the Holiday Inn. Yeah, and Holiday Inn's far. another couple miles yet. Yeah. And it's another about a mile and a half that way to where they got the roadblock and back. So she's going to be walking like six and a half, seven miles to yeah. go get her dogs because stupid idiots think, I got a badge, I can tell you what to do. Well, the Constitution says you can't. Constitution was written to protect us from our government. So we're going to go back because he's just, I'm not going to make him walk any more than that. No. So. Because the further we go, the further we got to go back. I know. All right, so there he is. And it's really windy. I don't think we can get the drone up either. Do you? Shut up. I've added up more wind than this. You can put it in the parking lot right here. <laughs> All right. Let's go back to the truck and then we'll go home, okay? <laughs> okay, guys, so we're in the back of a truck. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. The guy and maybe his son or something. Oh, well, there they all hanging out yeah. at the bowling alley. But, uh, oh, yeah. Look at them um, all. <laughs> but anyway, um, the guy stopped and asked us, You all right? I said, Well, we're heading that way. He says, you know, if you want to ride, I gotta stop up here real quick, and then I'll give you a ride back where you're going. I said, sure, because of Bruno, and he said, jump on back in, yeah. and they helped her get up in. Yeah, because I can't. I suck. So yeah, that's pretty cool, man. Really appreciate that. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. So yeah, that's pretty cool. I think he said we gotta go pick up a couple people. Yeah. Up here at the racetrack. So. Yeah, he's trying to back. Yeah, and then we're gonna. We're just having drop us off up here at the uh, where they got the roadblock, so that's pretty nice. Of them. I really appreciate that. And they even got this roadblock here. Oh my god! Wow. Yeah, they got this roadblock here. So see oh, we. Yeah. Look at that. Yeah. Yeah, they they overdid it. I think. Yeah, I think they just. Well, like I said, you put a piece of tin on your chest and. You know, you can tell people what to do. Wait for them over. Wait for them over. Now she's barking orders. Wait for them over here. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you for violating our rights. Yeah, yeah, he needs to. Yeah, that's bullshit. And there's no water here. There's nothing. It's there's nothing. The water's down. Oh yeah, it's gone. Maybe there might be some power lines down there. No. Anyway. Yeah, that's, that's nuts. yeah, that's crazy. Jesus. So he gave us a ride all the way back to the truck. Yeah, that's great. We was talking to him back there for a few minutes. He he was actually in some flood waters. He can get back in there. He said. Man, if it wasn't for the dog, I'd take you back and I'd take you back in there and let you get some footage. Uh, if uh, too bad the air conditioner didn't work, Monkey could have stayed in here yeah. in the air with Bruno while I went and done some filming. But yeah, yeah, really nice guy. He's giving people rides at places they gotta go, so that's pretty cool. All right, yeah, this is yeah they got all these streets blocked off. So I'm just gonna show you if if they can let you walk in, they can't close the streets. They don't own these streets. We own these streets. It really makes me upset. What really makes me upset is they wouldn't let that woman go to get her dog. She had to walk. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's not right. All right, guys. So that's pretty much it. Storm's over. We did good. Did really well. Everything survived here, huh? Yeah, yeah. Bruno survived. <laughs> He's happy. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry he couldn't get any drone footage for you, but, you know, it's just, it is what it is, so. We if, tried. Well, if if he wasn't with us, we would have went ahead and walked the rest of the way down there. So. <laughs>
Um, but yeah, all right, guys. Thanks for watching. We're okay. Thanks for all your comments. We appreciate it. We'll see you guys in the next one. Shea Bear to Myth the Man Ledge. I'm out for now, Mama. Thanks for the show. Bye, y'all. Say bye, Bruno. All right, we'll see you guys. <laughs> bye, bye.